Hello and welcome to Endless Mode, I'm Captain Emoji. And I'm Mysterious Gamer X. And we're about to go up the thing. Anybody else really weirded out by Splatoon with no music? Because I am really weirded out with Splatoon with no music. It's true, all we get are the weird machine noises. That vague electronic hum. That ain't good. But hey, at least we're hitting the, I don't know, throat phase? Spinal phase. Oh! That did kind of look like a vertebra, maybe. Oh, and yeah. then that bit in the middle, I guess, cartilage? <laughs> kinda? Okay, so the battery's in the central elevator, and then we can go to the surface. Hooray! Oh, you get to ride the bone train! <sighs> I suppose you're right. I never thought about it like that. <laughs> Okay, it looks like Craig and Agent 3 are ahead of us, so that's kind of weird, but alright. Sounds like they're free climbing the building. Which, I mean, given all the hoopla you've had to go through and the fact that they may not have guns, okay, I can kind of see it. Yeah. I mean, I'm definitely picturing Craig using his cane as some kind of, like, grapple hook or something. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess Pearl has a helicopter they just like using. It's so a that's... touring helicopter for touring. Fair enough. I'm not gonna lie, I'm definitely picturing the death clock murder copter. <laughs> oh, hey. Oh, look, it's Agent 3. They got they that have... cool cape and everything. I was gonna say, so, uh, Splatoon, Splatoon 3, can we have capes? <laughs> That'd be cool. Oh, no! Oh, no. Oh, that's not a good headgear. That's, that's not a good headgear at all. That's bad. Anything that messes with your eyes like that, that's bad. Oh, they're so cool. It's supposed to be that cool. <laughs> and they're putting out the uh, uh, sanitized octoling colored ink. Which is a nice touch. No baller. Baller always bad. Agent 3 is a baller, though. True. <laughs> Ouch. Gotta get the high ground. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, that went pretty well for you, actually. Ouch. Once they knocked you off the high ground, I was, not gonna lie, a little worried. Stop dodging, you jerk. I'm not using dualies, you don't get a dodge roll. Yeah, I... I was gonna ask about that. Uh... <clears throat> I don't like him being able to use everyone's, like, special abilities against us. Not a, not a fun time. How much ink do you have? Well, it's not their ink. It's oh. that big tumor. That's true. Hopefully it's not their ink. They kill themselves doing this. I was gonna say, yeah, like, uh, when you were doing the, uh, the ink jet that whole time. Like, it's extenuating circumstances, life or death stuff. And yet you still stopped doing it once you got out of the phase where you had to. Okay. Like, you're not still jetpacking right now, for instance. God, no. Oh, no. Ah! Oh, gotcha! Nice job! I do like that it still shows the same, like, oh, yeah. multiplayer match style stuff. Yeah. It's Shoot. a good touch. Yeah, right? Try try not to pick up any brain damage, okay? <laughs> any more brain damage. Now, cut you... I suppose Zink wouldn't cut a rope. Why did I think that would work? I mean, I thought he'd be able to squid form out of that. I don't know if he can. What, squid form? Yeah. Old Inklings uh, go through a self-drying process to stay alive. Really? Yeah. He's a 
He's a dried squid. He might be. Like a like a squid jerky snack. <laughs> oh my god! I think I might be the only person in history that's ever called Craig Cuttlefish <laughs> a snack. But uh, all right, there we go. Oh. Oh boy. Nah, the Fair internet's hardest, gonna remember that Fair forever. Hardest to get to it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he did look handsome in the sunken scroll pictures that's I think, true I think he might have been considered you know handsome back in the day we're on the surface we win roll credits hooray oh god I don't know why I thought of this but this reminds me of the ending to uh, Bomberman Act Zero <laughs> Where you get to the surface after all of the stages and shenanigans, and then it's just everything's dead. <laughs> like you, yeah, I suppose. It has that same, you know, well, you panning weren't... shot of the horizon and, like, dead buildings. You weren't wrong about the helicopter. The heck is that? It is the murder copter. And they brought a fleet with them. How many helicopters do you own, Pearl? <laughs> They're the world's 13th largest economy. They just passed Belgium. <laughs> Oh, uh, rap battle. Well, yeah, we're having the fun, like, <laughs> hilarious, uh, uh, like, the credits are going to start Yeah, no, it's the there. rap outro. This is great. Right. The cat, Captain Cuttlefish, played by Will Smith. <laughs> uh, guys? This could be an issue. What, is this Ghostbusters two and a half? I mean, my first thought was, uh, this looks like something out of a Bioshock game. <laughs> okay. So that's a people. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay. I like that it was using a Hello Fellow Kids filter. Yeah, it was. Oh, boy. My dude, you've never met a human, have you? <laughs> yeah. Did you seriously blend up over 10,000 other octolings? That's disturbing. A massive jerk. And those are the ones that, like, Those are the ones that made it to the end. Those are the ones that made it to the end and stuff. Uh... And then think of all of the uh, sanitized uh, octarians, which are... Yeah, they get showered in that goop, and then it's all Mind Control City. Right. Man, that is dark. Jesus, Nintendo, what's wrong with you? Who hurt you? Ooh. This is a kid's game. Ooh. This is a place of fun. Commander Tartar finally inked enough terrain. He's about to use his special. <laughs> Uh, it's okay, Marina's on it. She's got a laptop, she can hack anything. Okay, so how do we... yeah. Oh, I like the Squid Sisters stickers. That's a good sticker. Yeah. Well, I suppose that's a people. Hey, it's solar powered, it's a green death ray. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm really good at turf wars, so... What else we got? Wait, so you brought the touring helicopter and a fleet of other helicopters carrying massive hyper Did you notice bombs. how good the art of you was, though? Heck yeah! <laughs> also very good art. We got Shoujo Pearl over there. Yeah. Okay, it's okay. I'm sure you can still shout really loud. So... Marina does the same thing that a lot of fan artists do, it seems like, and she doesn't make Pearl's forehead as big. <laughs> just just point that out. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> uh, moral support? Be yeah, the hype, go. Man. hype man. You're gonna have to get Pearl amped up, because she's gonna have to use a special without using any ink. It's true. But he's got headphones, though. He just has to wear the one headphone and pump his hand in the air and get the crowd round up. Heck yeah. Like, that's what your hype man does, right? Defending Goblis from ultimate doom. Alright.
I mean, they brought all those helicopters. Where are all of the Inklings right now? Are they in the middle of a splat fest? Like, you know, they're just... I know, they have ADD open. and they forget to show up to things, but I'm just saying. <laughs> Grizzco's open, it's still early in the morning. <laughs> they're all at their crappy part-time jobs, is that what you're telling me? No, that tracks. That does. Or they're sleeping in. Or they're sleeping in, after a long night of part-time jobs. Okay. Oh, I kind of thought this was going to be the end credits music, but, uh... Well, Fly Off Go Fly is apparently final boss music. Okay. I was going to say, there's one over there. You missed one uh, blue one. Oh, I did miss it. Okay. That's okay. I think these are all timed. Uh, yeah. Yeah. You have to wait for Marita to fire the next set of them. Okay. There we go. I do like that the super bombs are like spotlights for your fun concert battle. It's very oh, yeah. good. Oh, that's super handy. Also, now that there's spotlights in a musical battle, I do feel like the uh, the Ghostbusters reference fits more than mine does. Because <laughs> they did fill the statue with music in order to make it walk. So. Seriously though, I'm glad, I'm glad you guys brought a dozen other helicopters with these prototype weapons of mass destruction Marina was building in Pearl's <laughs> Garage. Also, why are you building these in <laughs> Pearl's Garage? Well, you know, they could be... Ah, crap, I missed. Hold on. Need to go back. Need to go fast. <laughs> Oh no. You got it. You're doing fine. Oh, I'm doing. The next set just dropped. I think that means you're you're more or less in line. Yeah, no, it'll be fine. And I mean, if not, you just, you know, pick yourself up and try again, I guess. Oh god, okay. Oh! That was clever. Oh, I think there was the, there was a grapple point they were expecting you to use. Uh. Oh no. Ooh. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, you were just starting over. That's all. all it right. does look like that might have been like. The last or next to last set of those. I think that is the last stage, and that's disconcerting. Oh. Well, I mean, we wouldn't have wanted the fans to miss this. Look at that. Yeah. I mean, it sneezed no. on Incopolis. Not gonna skip. Who skips the ending? <laughs> that's not fair. If if I get to this and I have a rough time with it, I might. Like, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna judge anyone else for wanting okay. to play with their octoling and like the next Splatfest or whatever. I, b I blame I blame Craig. He wasn't helping me enough for that. Clearly. I do have a problem with trying to arc shots into things instead of just putting the reticle on them. The game doesn't work like that. Okay. So... To take a break near the point on its neck, so yeah. I think they expected that first one to be easy enough that you'd have time to spare. So that they could explain how the rest of this goes. Okay. Good job. Nice. Now if I don't miss this one, <laughs> I should be good. Oh, freestyling. I think... No. So I think the reason that uh, you have to wait for them to circle around like they do is because it is the one that Pearl and Marina are, are on that has the, the bombs. That makes sense. Because I just watched their, their little party, uh, party plane, you know, fly by, and that's where the bombs show up. So... Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, 
All right. I want a shifty station with these. Right? With the uh, randomly colored octobombs uh, popping up from time to time. Too bad you can't just shoot Tartar through the eye. <laughs> right? I think that would have been a, a fun secret ending of sorts. Those ones are too high for you to get at. Oh, so there you go. Got this one. That last Suck one? it, Tartar. Nice. You plugged him up. Heck yeah. I hear there's bonus dialogue if you manage to do it with about 30 seconds left. Oh. You have to look that up online later. Or get better scrub. <clears throat> you know, whichever. <laughs> Ah, uh, Jerk's not gonna take his loss with Grace. I hate sore losers. <laughs> You'd think after all this, he might reconsider, uh, uh, like, oh, maybe, maybe they're really good at what they do. Maybe, maybe I was wrong in my assessment. No kidding. Okay, so... I just think that she was just back there, like, <laughs> chugging a tea in the go. <laughs> of all the ways for doing me to end, I wasn't expecting a boom struggle. I love it. It's amazing. <laughs> also, what proportion of pearl is lung? <laughs> Well, they don't have any bones. It's just a giant diaphragm. Bet you weren't expecting a tiny pink squid to ruin your day. That's pretty good. Well, to be fair, Tartar didn't know that anyone still had that special. That's true. <laughs> That's some vintage gear. That's true. That's not legal in Turf Wars these days. That's vintage uh, Splatoon 1 gear. Sorry, Pearl, your girlfriend is too heavy. You're just stuck there for now. <laughs> okay, but, like, somebody's gonna wake Agent 3 up, right? They've been out for a while. <laughs> oh, there they go. I was gonna say, hopefully... <laughs> Giant band <-aid. laughs> That'll fix it. I'm not gonna lie, for a second there, I was like, oh, that's gonna be horrible to remove from their hair, but I'm like, oh, wait, no. It's just squid material. It'll be fine. Yeah. Now they just shape out, and then they come back, and they just take it off the ink. It's fine. Yep. <laughs> wow! That was pretty cool. No kidding. They definitely went all out on the ending. Yeah, they did. One of the best... $20 DLCs I've ever seen. Yeah. Uh, it's definitely a DLC that feels worth it. Um, mm. I know people have varying opinions on like the Breath of the Wild DLCs, like each one. And then, uh, you know, we've gotten some free updates on some of the other games that they've made. But, uh, no, this is, this is $20 worth of DLC and then some. I mean, it's more stages than the main game is. Yeah. And then uh, a host of, you know, new content and a uh, new playable race. Four new customization options for your uh, main character. Yeah. A bunch of new equipment and stuff that got added in for this. I do want more hairstyles for the Octo race. I know oh, I've definitely. said it before, but I'm going to keep saying it. Maybe split two and three, it'll be a bit more even split starting out. Yeah. I think if people can pick Squids or uh, Octos starting out, like, at the get-go, 
Uh, yeah. I think we'll see a more even split of uh, Inklings to Octolings. Because it does seem like now that it's been out for a bit, a lot of people have gone back to the character that they've been playing with for a year. Mm -hmm. And that's fine. I mean, yeah, no, no judgment there. Just, you know, I think everyone got real attached to their main characters, so that their Octolin characters are sort of their secondary character. Mm -hmm. So what's with Octolings and heels? Seriously. They're, they're fashionable? Uh, I guess. Also, you're an Octoling boy. You're short. True. True. Yeah, you definitely... Well, I mean, yeah, but I the Octoling girls have heels, too. It's, I know, it's not fair. I'm just saying, Marina's <laughs> wearing pumps. Yeah. She yeah, doesn't wear heels, because, you know, pearl. And she's still taller than I am. Yep. The four-inch heels on her, and she's still... Ugh. She's pearl, so tall. Pearl has platforms. <laughs> she does. I didn't notice it until, uh... Until I got the shoes from the Amiibo, but... Oh, yeah, no, they they make your inkling a good four inches taller. <laughs> She's still so small. Yep. if we'll get to see more of the world like outside of Inkopolis. Oh yeah, that might be right. Just because, I mean, is that all Inkopolis there on the horizon? We only see the main square, so. Yeah, I think I think that entire thing is Inkopolis. Mm. So, I think it's equivalent to, well, it's probably an equivalent to Tokyo, but, I mean, yeah. or New York, or any other coastal megapolis. Heck yeah, buddy. You did it. You're free. You don't ever have to wear that leather again unless you want to. Yep. You can take off your little medical bracelet thing and... <laughs> I'll catch you later. Yeah, thanks for watching.